What's up, gamers? Welcome. I apologize for not being here yesterday. Unfortunately, I was unwell and was asleep all day. But today, I'm feeling good. And we're going to play more Psychonauts. This is part two of my playthrough. Let's go. Game. There it is. And... The controller's not working. One hour of technical issues later. Oh, wait. I know what I did wrong. Okay, it was kind of my bad. Like, Windows wasn't focused on the game. That's why it wasn't working. Without further ado, ba -bam, let's get inside the Psychonauts world. Oh, yeah, I'm on the brain. I very much enjoy being on the brain. Can we start new game? No, 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 no. Continue. Yes. What's this? Load a save game. I think we continue. We only have one save game. Oh, yeah, finally, I'm back in Psychonauts. God damn, the technical issues today were crazy. So here we are inside this dude's lab. I kind of forget what this guy's name is. Is the game too loud? Why, yes it is. But it's okay, because I can turn it down at any time. Hello, my dude. This old crazy dude. Son, I will teleport you deep into that solid rock over there. You don't knock that <laughs> That's funny. Son, I will teleport you deep into that solid rock over there. You don't knock that off. <laughs> Go on then, teleport me into the rock. Show me what you're made of. Okay, it doesn't look like he's going to actually teleport me into the rock. So, uh, what are the controls in this game? I've got to like... Oh, wow, the animations are so good. Look at this. Ah, oh, that jump animation. Makes me so happy. There you go, I remembered the button. Oh yeah, what's titanium, my dude? Titanium is a very rare psychoreactive mineral that crashed here on a meteorite hundreds of years ago. Oh. It responds to psychic waves, ah. focuses them, Sorry. amplifies them. It can make psychics more psychic, but ah. it can also make that unstable real. people more unstable. Oh, no. Not everyone can handle that much activity in that part of their brain. It can drive them completely out of their gourd. Gives this valley an interesting history. <gasps> Tony Observer! Hello. How's it going, Tiny Observer? Today, it was so hard to get this game running today. I don't know what's happened. I changed nothing to my computer. My, I changed nothing. Yet, this week, my computer didn't want to run the game. Last week, it was fine. So that's why I'm late to today, uh, for today's stream. But we got a good hour, at least, playing this. I'm glad you made it to the stream today. How you doing? What does all this equipment do? What does all this equipment do? Well, up here, it's all in terror. Down that hallway is the observation room. No test going on in there right now. Maybe later. Oh, yes. And beneath us, I have special machines for rebuilding side challenge markers and detangling mental cobwebs. You should go familiarize yes. yourself with those. They'll come in. I better go. Lots of work to do. I'd better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Thank you, Mr. Old Crazy Guy. Glad you could get the game running. Me too. I don't know what was up today. Like, it wasn't- my stream wasn't broadcasting properly. It was making the audio spaz out and stuff. Yeah, I had a lot of technical issues one after the other. Um, I'm trying to now work out what I should be doing. And I do have a journal here. It's been like a week since I played the game, so I'm like, how do I play this again? I'm trying to figure this out. Hopefully it won't be as bad next week, because I'll have played it twice. Surely my brain will have... I uh, figured out not to forget how to play. If that makes sense. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is all coming back to me. Things I gotta do. That's what I'm looking for. Complete Sasha's advanced training. Hmm. Where is that? Whispering Rock. Oh, this is strange. Oh, oh, oh. Whispering Rock. So what's this here? Are these, are these like my challenges? I land a more... Ah, real. Alanda's Pride. Oh, I see. These are my reels. Yes, yes, I remember. So, these are my, like, mem- I need to find these. Okay. So, I can see a card down there, so I may as well get, grab that. Good news! You have enough cards to build a new Psy Challenge marker. Sci Tiny Observer says, I'm alright. Glad you could get the game running. I already read that. Yeah, I'm glad as well, dude. And I'm glad you're okay this week. 
Just buy a Psychor at the camp store and use the Agent Krill's special lab equipment to put the cards and core together into a new marker. Woo! Woo, that's a lot of information to digest. Let's go, gamers. Oh, a sploosh! <gasps> a sploosh! The sploosh is nice. Even the sploosh is well animated in this game. They even thought to animate the splooshes. Now, before you go electrocuting yourself, let me tell you how these babies work. And tell me now, how it works. Here is a mental cobweb detangler. Ooh. I know what those are. Mental cobwebs are... You see, when an area of your psyche is neglected for too long, mental cobwebs form. Mm -hmm. Now, up in the camp store, they sell a very special device known as a mental cobweb duster. Ooh. You can take a projection of it into the mental world with you and use it to extract any cobwebs you find. Already the found a few of those. The cobweb psychic energy on the real world side. So, you can take what you collect back here, hook it up to the loom, and weave that tangled mess into something useful. Okay. Like a card from a side challenge marker, which brings us to this fellow I wonder how here. many mental cobwebs I have. Nine side cards into this guy. Says Tiny Observer. One side core, also sold in the company store for nominal fee, <laughs> and it will kick out a bona fide side challenge marker, which will earn you a promotion to a higher rank. Rank up enough? You'll earn new psychic abilities. All right. It. Yeah, it's a lot. My mental cobwebs in there. Still, I feel like yeah. Cores in there. Okay. And soon I'll be able to burn stuff. Yeah. Basically, <laughs> have fun. That's a good way of simplifying things. I'll be able to burn stuff soon. Woo! But yeah, uh, how many mental cobwebs do you have, Tiny Observer? I reckon I have a lot. Um, I think. Like, how to get this game running was a mental cobweb I had to dust off today. How to get it running on the stream, because... This game doesn't stream very well, I've got to say. I guess it's an, an older game, and that's why. It's not... Uh, it doesn't work well with OBS. Oh, hello. I just like to come down here to hear your voice. I already took that option. Um, where should I go? I actually want to go back outside oh, of here. I just like to come down here to hear your voice. Pop in any <laughs> so that's the option if you just want to go back. So anyway, I was going to see if there's anywhere else I could look around in here. Yeah, there is up here. Okay, so let's go up here if I can. I can't jump that high, can I? Oh, I can double jump. I almost forgot. Okay, cool. Haven't had to use the double jump that much yet. It is a nice looking double jump. Look at that. Okay, so what is this room? Um, can't really do anything here. Nope, can't do anything. Okay, let's get out of here. Time reserver says too many. Yeah, I reckon I, I reckon most of my brain is cobwebs, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Most of my brain is cobwebs. Okay, I don't think there's much else I can do in here, so let's get out. I'm a bit, like, blurry. My memory's a bit foggy, I mean, on what I, where I'm supposed to go next. Where would you like me to take... Um, where should I go, Agent Observer? I mean, Tiny Observer. You're now an agent, like me. A Psy agent. Take me to the kids' cabins. Uh, I'm gonna go here. The geodesic psycho isolation Bring chamber. The geodesic, psycho isolation geodesic. Roger that, Ranger Crawler. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I think they do it in I order. Oh yeah, yeah. Into a hole in Ooh. The girl's cabin. I'm hiding, and I thought. Hey yeah. Yo. Hey yeah. Yo. 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 <laughs> I like how she says not now as if like look, look we can do this later okay just not now don't beat me up now we can do it later I've talked to these dudes already can't remember what they wanted ah this game is like a uh, it's like a trippy dream Is my health low or something? My heart's beating in this game. I think my health is low. Hmm. 
Oh yeah, I can do that. So. What's wrong with this squirrel? Fuck. I mean, whoops, I killed a squirrel. I didn't expect him to die. That was quite unexpected. I found- Hey! 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 He had my acorn! I found the acorn! Isn't that like a special, uh, thing? There it is. How do I get that? Do I have just have to be fast? I'm gonna get that acorn! Here we go! Ah! I'm not fast enough. What if I hide here? And then... Ha! 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 Give me that acorn! What if I hide here? <laughs> He's tempting me. I'm gonna get that acorn. Ha! <laughs> Damn it. What if I hide here? He doesn't like it when I hide here. Too close. What if I hide here? And then I like sneak around slowly. Like this. I can- there's a sneak animation! Frick yeah. Come on, we can do this. I look so stoned in this game. Rasputin looks so stoned right now. No. You want to go to the actual chamber behind the fencing? Oh, I see. So, in the inside there. Okay, well, the, my... My attempts at getting the acorn didn't work. Nine, nine! Oh yeah, I can go inside. Nice. So this is the geodesic isolation chamber. Geodesic. Hey! Psycard! Gimme, gimme, gimme! Why is there a crying child? Stop crying. I'm trying to collect psy cards. Is that the bear again? Oh, there's the bear. Can't get me, bear! Can't get me. Oh shit, can he get me? No. There's no bathroom in here! Oh no! We must save this child! We cannot let them commit the mistake of peeing their pants in school. People will remember him forever as the pee panther. Pants Pia. Where is he? Or oh, is he inside there? I want to get this psych out here. And I want my heart to stop beating. Can How do we get health in this game? The heart beating sound. Oh god, the, the crying so annoying. Stop crying in my ears. It's so loud. I can't jump that high. A lizard. An arrowhead thing. I'm starting to remember how to play. Let's go! Okay, how the hell did we get inside this thing? He's obviously inside it. Oh, there you go. Thanks. I thought I was gonna have to eat my own arm. <laughs> what is this thing? It's a GPC. What a strange looking child. Isolation chamber. GPC. Oh, man. Cool. Cool? Do you have any idea what this does? Something cool? Uh, no. It's a six sensory deprivation tank. Mm, a hermetically sealed cool. metaphysical hotbox. Nice. It's solitary confinement for psychics. That sounds awesome. Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah, the staff hasn't put any kids in the GPC since <sighs> the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Bully and dwarf accomplice should assault own size or larger only. While I'm cooler, Perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. <laughs> hey, wait! Hi, chat lizard, you're gonna die. Oh. Okay, so maybe I can go inside the geodesic isolation chamber and kick some ass. Hmm. Looks like one of the buttons is missing. Hmm. I need to find the button, eh? Yep. Okay, where do we find the button to the geodesic isolation chamber? Can I open this? Yep. Hmm. 
Doesn't look like it. Looks like I can only open the main one. You have the button? I have the button! Why didn't he say so? Why didn't he say so, eh? Eh? Oh yeah, he gave me the button. The old man did, didn't he? Is that what happened? Call me crazy, but I have a weird feeling that that button Sasha gave me goes here. Yeah, now put it there. Call me crazy, but I have a weird feeling that that button Sasha gave me goes here. Then put it there, you silly Billy. Oh yeah, wait, wait. Don't I have to like do something in the items to do it? Oh god. This game's complicated. Um. I don't know how to open inventory with a controller. So there's an inventory. Is that the problem here? There's an inventory. <gasps> oh yes, the backpack. There we go. Ah! To view your current psi powers. I got it now. Oh yeah, I got I got the button. Boom. Thank you so much, Tiny Observer. I would have been stuck for a while without your help there. <laughs> Woo! That, that looks very strange. What the fuck? What the fuck is, happened there? What the? What am I looking at, Chad? Like, how did that open? What is that white thing? Oh well, let's go down. Let's not question things here. I'm here for the advanced training. Oh yeah, I'm here for the advanced freaking training. I'll get those files out of your way just as soon as I'm <gasps> done with the mental health. Test. I remember. I need to get the mental health. Give me the mental health. Wait, what's the orange one? Is that like super mental health? <gasps> More boxes. Whoa. I did not know there was a ledge grab, that was so lucky. Wow, this place looks cool. This game has no right being this cool. I want to play Psychonauts 2 now. I'm <laughs> having so much fun on 1, I'm already excited for Psychonauts 2. Which goes on sale a lot, I've noticed. I don't. It, does that mean no one's buying it? It always goes on sale. I think more people should buy it. If it's any... If it's half as good as this game, it's gonna be good, right? So what are we gonna learn? Bending spoons? Burning stuff? So hard. Look at the little mental healths. What are we gonna learn, my dude? I've been hearing a lot about head explosion, and I was wondering... Science, Rasputin. That is what we practice down here. Not parlor tricks. If you are serious about exploring the possibilities of your mind, step up to the brain tumbler, and we'll begin. Oh, brain yeah. Tumbler? Okay, that looks like a rocket or a big laser that's gonna kill me or something. I like the decor under here. This is not this is a nice place. This would be a nice place to hang out with friends. I would like this a lot. You know, some drink have some drinks around here, looks cozy, lots of little chairs. You can just go over and sit on this tree stump. Oh that that's one of those connecty things, isn't it? I can go down there and talk to that little robot lady voice connecty wecty tunnels okay let's talk again my dude well i get in trouble with oh, yeah. she told me not to take any paranormal training while i'm here step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready i'm calling everyone my dude today it's the kind of mood i'm in wait i have to put my head inside it so What's this hairdryer thing do? Hairdryer? Ah, you're ready for, for the that. brain tumbler. With this device, we will send you deep into your own psyche. Good. Where you should Sounds find fun. unparalleled insight and power. Excellent! Tumble away! <laughs> now just relax. This won't hurt. <laughs> Unless something really very bad happens. <laughs> oh. Is this what the inside of my mind looks like? Not yet. 
you're still traveling to the astral plane. Ooh. This is a tiny corner of what we call the collective unconscious, a place in which all of our unconscious minds are connected. You have just begun your training, Rasputin, so many of the connections with other minds are still not developed for you, and those doorways remain just out of reach. But the more you explore the mental world, the more connections you will form. Right now, the only unconscious world you can enter is that one. Okay. Your own. Step through it, and we'll continue. I see, so I... I'm in the astral plane, and these doors all lead to different people's brains or something. So these are other people's doors. I want to go through my door, because that's the only one I'm allowed to go through right now. Let's go! I think that's... That's how I under understood it anyway. Rasputin, can you hear me? Yes. Sasha? Where am I? You are inside your own mind, but I'm not sure where. Tell me, what can you see? I see a run-down gypsy caravan. Do you recognize it? Yes. It's where I was born. <laughs> I see. Where he was okay. born? Jeez. How do you remember where you were born? <clears throat> okay. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme those figments, baby. Hello, little caterpillar. Sasha, I'm going inside the caravan. No, what not yet. There's, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's a hippopotamus. I think it's a hippopotamus. Gimme! What the fuck? Oh, it's one of these things. Rasputin's getaway. So let's try and decipher what this means. So, da da ba da ba. There was a circus, and a man used to grab women by their hair and throw them up in the sky, and it was beautiful. And there were children involved as well. I've just realised this looks quite dangerous for the children. And then, ha ha! He hailed Hitler. By the looks of it. And the kid was sad at the paper, but everyone else was all right. Then they all lifted weights. But Rasputin was there now. Is he? Wait, is this Rasputin as well? Maybe that's Rasputin. Let's try and, and see where Rasputin is here. He could be the kid on top doing the handstand on the woman's head. Um, he could be observing like through we could be looking through his own eyes and then maybe he got a pamphlet and he was like I'm going to join the circus as well maybe I don't know but they're all doing little weights he's doing 70 pounds or kilos with the little, little feet there while reading a book that's pretty impressive um yeah so he's reading everyone else is uh doing weights getting jacked this guy over here is giving some side eye. This old man over here is giving some side eye to Rasputin for some reason. The baby likes what he sees as well. <gasps> oh, oh! Wait, is that the pamphlet he got here? So that must be Rasputin, the kid with the hair, black hair. <gasps> oh, oh! He reads the thing. Oh, he he reads the psychic thing. Yes, I know what this is. Ah, so this. Oh, I, I get it, I get it. The mysterious man with the hat here. We see him on the side. He came in, he sees the circus, he's like, whoa, that kid on top is freaking crazy. Maybe he could be a psychic. I'm gonna, maybe he could, he could be a psi guy. One of those psi people. So he gave him the pamphlet. And then he was reading it while doing his weights and shit. And then he was like, oh, yes. This look very nice. And then the guy was like, no! I'm ripping it up. You perform at my show, Pinocchio. I mean Rasputin. You perform at my show. And then all the others were like looking at him like, oh, that's so sad. We're, we're very sad for Rasputin because he wanted to go in on his own way. But this old man is like, no, you will perform at my show because you're very good at doing handstands on women's heads. And then Rasputin snuck away into his world's smallest pony little cart. Oh yes. Is there a pony inside there? 
Ah, oh, there was a pony inside there. And it's the world's smallest pony. That's so cute. He ran away on the small pony. This is this is a riveting story. All told through uh, these comic, comic strips. Whispering Rock. So we got to the Whispering Rock psychic retreat. And it looks like he got there on a logger's uh, truck in the end. It, I hope the pony's all right. I want one, says Tiny Observer. Yeah, me too. Tiny Observer needs a tiny pony to ride on. And let's see what's next. Rasputin. Okay, well, cool. We we th That's all. So that's how he got there. That was a cool story. That was nice. I like that. I also like this smoke that's everywhere. It looks very nice. Yeah, I'm going inside the TV. I mean the caravan. I'm not sure. Whoa! Well, that was bright. Fuzzy. Very bright for my eyes. Very bright in here. Uh oh. I'm what? inside the static. No, I'll figure it out. I can't get out of here, my dude. Aha! Oh, I can break it. That's so cool. Oh, that was epic. That was nice. Rasputin, are you okay? What do you see now? I see a small, bunny-like animal thing. <laughs> An unfamiliar animal entity in a dream often represents a primal fear or memory. Follow it and it should lead you somewhere mm -hmm. important. Check. Okay. Okay, Mr. Bun. You and I are gonna be tight. Wherever you go, I go. Like two peas in a Hey! Come back here! <laughs> Wait, is he my like spirit guide or some shit? Oh, the familiar animal entity. So yeah, basically. Give me the potato. I just got a potato figment. That was nice. I got a I got a backpack thing. Hello, little caterpillar thing. You're so weird. I love you. There's a tornado above me. I wonder if that's relevant to anything. Let's go! Figment time! Gotta get all the figments. What's this? <gasps> Mental health. Ooh, yucky. Okay, so there are weird plant monsters in my brain. Need to kill them all. What are these bouncy things? Oh, th those were arrowheads. So you can find arrowheads in the wild. Not just underground. Okay, getting lots of pigments here. And arrowheads. Come here. Give me a little arrowheads. So if I break this, will I get more arrowheads? Why is there a, a stake over here? Hey, come here! Come here! There's a wibbly wobbly stake over here. That's nice. Maybe Rasputin loves steak. Come back, Figment! Come back, arrowheads! Okay, and more bones. Very bony inside Rasputin's mind. It looks like a lot of things here are smashable. And give you a lot of um, arrowheads. Just backtracking a bit to see if I missed anything smashable. I don't think I did. I'm gonna whack this snake though, just because it jiggles nicely. Okay, and away we go. Up, up, up into the strange, strange world of my imagination. Uh, Sasha? What is it? Another bunny? No. This is more of a super scary flaming eyed demon kind of deal. Oh, oh dear. Hmm. What? Okay, I'm pulling you out of there. Just give me a second. Uh, Sasha? Hold on, I'm still getting some unusual interference. It's fascinating. As if someone else... Agent 9? Sorry, almost ready. Sasha! Okay. There is a big demon. Ah! Hmm. That should not have happened. Hey, I missed a we figment. There again. was a figment in oh. there. I don't think I need to be in the tumbler with the glowy eye guys anymore. Suit yourself. You know, in many tribal societies, learning to defeat the monsters you see in your dreams is considered a rite of passage. I can train you to fight. Come see me when you're ready. Do you guys do that in your dreams? Because I do. Well, I have. I've defeated monsters in my dreams before. It was pretty epic. 
Okay, so shouldn't I go back inside there? Let's check what my journal says. Defeat the big monster I saw. Okay, so I gotta go back in there. Okay, I'm ready to learn how to really fight. Oh, really? Hmm. What? Oh, uh, nothing. <clears throat> it's just that I didn't think you'd really take me up on that offer. It <laughs> usually scares the kids off. Well, not me. I'm ready to kill for my camp. Yeah. Listen, I'm sorry, but I can't train you. Agent Vodello would kill me. What's the big deal? What she doesn't know won't hurt her. You don't even have a marksmanship learner's permit. I could lose my job. I'll get one. Even if you used that secret passage over there and snuck into his sanctuary, Agent Cruller would never give you a marksmanship learner's permit. Agent Cruller? Never in a million... I'm off. Be right back after I talk with Agent Cruller. Yeah, let's get that thing from Cruller. See ya, Sasha. Thanks for nothing. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Cruller? She thinks I'm Agent Cruller. Let's go to Ford's. I mean, my sanctuary. So, I need to go to my sanctuary. Let's go to Ford's. I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, noble psycho master. <laughs> this game's great. You feeling better today? Yeah, a lot better. A lot better. Get a marksmanship learner's permit from Fort Kreller. Thanks for asking, Tiny Observer. Yeah, yesterday I wasn't feeling so great. Wait, what? No, this isn't Kreller's place. I'm dumb. Is this Kreller? Agent Kreller? Oh, it is Kreller. Job. Okay, cool. Training. I'm smart. That is Kreller. Um, I need to fight better. Sasha says I need to learn how to fight better. You want to teach you advanced combat? <clears throat> yeah, I had a vision with a huge monster with yellow eyes and a big mouthful of gnashing teeth. Did it happen to spit anything at you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it was like an old diving helmet or something. I see. Mm. Yes, well, we'd better get you armed. Why? What's happening? Oh, nothing, nothing. Uh, prepare your mind. That's the motto of the Psychonauts. <clears throat> Here, this is a marksmanship learner's permit. It will only work when you're in Sasha's mind. Once you complete his shooting range, you'll get the real merit badge and you can side blast anywhere you want. Thanks. Side blast? No, you'll find side blast out. sounds fun. We can't have the camp overrun with big eyed garbage spitting monsters, can we? <clears throat> no, sir. Okay, time to do the side blast and I want to do a side blast. Go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rep. Okay, so I can side blast now. Um, let's see here. Ah, oh, I got my mer that was so easy to get my learner's permit. Okay, so where's the um where's the little hidey hole? Oh there it is. Damn it, it's up there. The little uh connecty tunnel. Don't worry, I know where it is. Boing! Boing. Why did I miss this game growing up? I was such a dumbass when I was a kid. Why didn't I buy this Where game? Would you like me to take you, Agent Crowler? Um, I probably bought a load of other crappy games <laughs> instead as well. Okay, so I need to go to Nine's lap. Is that right? Is it Sasha Nine? I think it is. Agent Nine's lap, please. With pleasure. Oh yeah, he's a so Sasha is Agent Nine, I think. Yeah, okay. It's all coming together. I got my learner's permit. Ha ha ha. Yeah, I got it. Check it out. Excellent. Well, my ass is covered. Are you sure you are ready to do this? It could be dangerous. Yes, I'm ready. Yes. Are you going to pull me into your mind like the coach did? <laughs> no offense, but it's time you saw what an organized mind looks like. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Did the other guy put a door on his head? I don't remember that. 
That's pretty sick. Titan Observer says, I think a lot of people missed out. Yeah, I think as, so as well. Welcome to my mind. I think it was just the timing of this game. It came so out at us at a bad uh, time. I mean... There's more here than meets the eye, but I've learned to keep it under strict control, and that's what I'm going to teach you. Control your feelings, your fears, your anger. You must learn to control them, focus them, concentrate them, and release them. As okay. therapy? No. As firepower, say something hideous and horrible jumps out at you. Something so disgusting that it simply must die. Ah, oh, it's so <laughs> tacky. I can't look directly at it, but I control those feelings, focus them, concentrate, <clears throat> and release. <laughs> and this game has good humor. I like that. Your turn. Ah, so tacky. Ah. Earn a real marksmanship merit badge in Sasha's mind. Okay, so. Psy Blast well time! Ah, oh, that feels good. Well Boom! Done, Raz. Keep shooting. That's cool. Excellent. A victory for good taste. That feels pretty now you good. Must drive for precision when targeting. Say you were set upon by multiple attackers. <laughs> But you need to dispense with them in a certain order. Eliminate these monsters in the proper sequence, and we can move on to the next lesson. Okay. I'm gonna kill them in the proper sequence. Um, so how do I do that? Do I just press R? Good shooting, Raz, but you are making it harder than it oh, needs okay. to be. You need to practice locking your mental focus. It makes targeting and evasive maneuvers much easier. Let's try again. This time, lock your mental focus. There you go. I got it. Good. Again. Good. Again. Oh, now. yeah. No. Is what this the what hell you is saw that? in your vision? Um, no. Well, it sure seemed a lot bigger in my head. Ah, problems often seem larger <laughs> in our heads than they really are. That's an important lesson to learn. But this is a sensor, an integral part of any sane person's no. mind. The sensors roam through your psyche, looking for thoughts that don't belong. Hallucinations, manias, waking dreams. The sensors hunt them down and censor them out. Why do they come after me? I'm not a mania. Yes, but you are a foreign entity in my mind. You technically don't belong here. Yes, but I was attacked in my own head. Yes, well, the brain tumbler could be malfunctioning, or you could be insane. We'll test for that later. For now, <laughs> blast it. I like that. I, the, the problems often seem larger in our heads than they really are. That's so true. So this was the big scary thing inside Rasputin's head, but inside this guy's head it's just a tiny little... tiny little nerd with a stamp. Oh, wow, I can do, like, flips and stuff. Look at this. Can we do a flip blast? Ah, oh, that's, that's cool. You can. That's the spirit. You can flip and blast at the just same time. I was having, and it's not dead. It has just returned to its basic form. Raw psychic energy. Go absorb it. It's good for your mental health. <laughs> Absorby Bobby. Yeah. As you absorb this energy, your mental health increases. Nice. But as you psi blast, you expend your will to do damage. So be on the lookout for these small, dense clusters of raw psychic aggression. Absorb these as well to make sure you always have enough firepower. Now I'll leave the machine on for you so you can practice. You have to blast 1,000 sensors to earn your marksmanship merit badge. Come back every day for practice and you should have enough in as little as three weeks. Mm -hmm. Three weeks? I only have a few days to earn all my merit badges and become a psychonaut. Slow and steady wins the race, my eager young friend. Now practice, slowly and carefully. Okay. Oh, man. I will practice. Wah! Is that all I gotta do? Whoops. Come on. Is this what I'm supposed to do right now? 
This is gonna take forever. I wonder if I can speed it up somehow. Hmm. I was wondering that too. Maybe this machine. There we go. Hmm. They're coming out faster, but still not fast enough. Okay, don't worry. I'm still not fast enough. Still not fast enough. Ah! Oh, it's hurt me. Still not fast enough. Really? This is pretty fast. Okay. I thought four was pretty fast, to be honest. Still not fast enough. What the? What do you mean? You're getting overrun by these dudes. How is that not fast enough? Ah! Pretty fun flipping around and using the side blast. Okay, still not fast enough. <laughs> you silly Billy! What are you doing? It's just got a skull on it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh yeah, come to Papa. Ruh-oh. Right, what have you done? This is not control. <laughs> this is chaos. I'll try to fix it. You stay here and keep the numbers under control. So this guy loves control and hates chaos. I'm a little bit like that sometimes. I don't like my environment to be like too chaotic because then I just feel like I can't, can't focus on anything. A little chaos is okay though. Like Too much chaos. That's too much for me. Help Sasha create get senses under control. Okay. Um, wait, can I? Hey, I can marry a galaxy! Whee! Boom! 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 Eat my dust. Give me your arrowheads. Give me your mental health. Whee! It's so fun! Hey, wait a minute. Whoa. Rasputin, see those valves? That is where the sensors are leaking out. Okay. Sky blast the valves to shut them down and get this area under control. Okay, that was weird. And he just popped out of there. Nice camera angles there. Yay! More tags for the bags. Hey! You stop. Yay, another vault. Sasha's first loss. <gasps> How tragic. Let's see what it's about. So there was a woman. And the woman... Ah, I see. He's a baby. We're looking through the eyes of a baby. And the woman must he be his mother. And she's giving him a lollipop. I think. And then the lady is feeding him feeding him porridge and he's like yes mummy this is amazing and then a man what is he doing the man came up behind his mother and his mother looked very happy about it but the baby the baby was crying out for his mother did this man kill the mother? I think she... he. <clears throat> or maybe she was falling faint down and then the man was catching her. I can't tell. Because over here there's a man crying as well. So that must be the husband? I think maybe she like fell faint and fell over or something. And then... Because look, the man is over here crying. So he's sad about it. The baby's sad about it. And mum is going to heaven. Oh, that's so sad. So that's Sasha's dad. And he cried and he dug a grave for their mummy. This is so sad. 
If only my Go XLR was working today and I could play the sad music. I'm going to put the sad music in post on the YouTube video. <laughs> Why? Why must Sasha lose his mummy? There we go. And then... Okay, so then the... the what? So now he watches his dad as he cries over the very large portrait of their mother. <clears throat> and Sasha's behind bars here in his crib, I reckon. These are quite well done, these um, comic strips, to be honest. They're really well done. You can, you can tell what's going on, even though they're quite low resolution. Aw. Oh. Poor Sasha. That, that's a mental scar for sure. Mental baggage. That's some heavy baggage there. Can I smush this pillow? No. Give me the tag. The hat box tag. Whoa! You get off for there. What the? What the heck is this? Why is it so bouncy? Ouchie. I'll side blast you! The side blast is pretty freaking fun. Go see Agent Sala to Krala to get a new Psy power. Woo! We're gonna get a new Psy power. Yeah, I agree, Tiny Zerva. That story was extremely sad. His poor mother. She was so beautiful. Why'd she have to go so soon? <clears throat> Boom! I don't like these weird little guys. Can I smush this box? No. They look pretty smushable. Ah! They're coming for me. They want to stamp me with a stamp. I will not let you stamp me. Jesus. Oh, what's this? Oh my goodness, what is this? Already maximum projection depth. What? I don't know what this is. Maybe it's like an, a healing or something. Bomb. I found it! Acha! It grew another one. Why'd it grow another one? Oh, it's over there. I see it. Yeah. Essentially extra life. Oh, I see. Oh, that was that was awesome. This game is has fun controls. I like blasting things. Oh, I feel like Eleven from Stranger Things. All these psychic abilities. I wonder what new. Uh, I wonder what abilities I'll unlock. I can't imagine what they'll be. So far, I'm liking the loadout of just like the side blast and the big hand. The big hand is cool. I want to go on this. Wing. Wing. Yay. I've already been here, haven't I? Yeah, I've already been here. Boom! 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 Good. Well, you got them all. Nice. There are some really fun abilities. Excited for you to find out. Yeah, I'm really excited. I, I just can't imagine what they'll be. Like, so far the abilities I have, that would be all I'd expect from a game from, like, this this era. Like, most games from this era, that, that would be all you would get for the whole game. And you, you would just be like, okay, that's what I have. You close one league down and another springs up. Well, come on. We've got to take care of these, too. Okay. So there's more to do. Okay. I thought I'd done it. Yep. Don't 
da 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 Can I look around the cube? Maybe I'll find more things. Just checking that there's no figments around here. I don't think there are. Rasputin is so awesome. Jump up these disco discs. Whoa, that was cool. Is he like a boss or something? That one seemed bigger than the other ones. I found the, the little bag. Yay, we found the little bag. Mm -mm -mm. She's so happy. See ya. Okay. We cleared out some of his mental baggage. <clears throat> yeah, that is a bigger one than normal, isn't it? It looks like Donkey Kong. It's fine though, still only takes a few blasts. How do I get this one up there? What's that? Whoa, 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 whoa! Yeah, how do I get up there? Hmm. Maybe I have to hit this. And then things will change. Yeah, okay, they've changed. Things have changed. I have to concentrate here. Well, this is a really fun platformer. As far as platformers go. I'll look for figments that I've missed. Okay, I think I missed some figments there. I could see some more. They were like higher up above me. What is this? Oh! Maybe I haven't missed any. Gimme, gimme, gimme the figments. Oh my goodness, they're bomb people. Are they gonna explode? Whoa, whoa, well that's weird. That's trippy when you run up the side. That's so cool. They could make a Psychonauts movie. Boom! Shouldn't have messed with me. Gimme, gimme, gimme the little things. Whoopsie, I, I got hurt. So my rank is determined by how many figments I have. Good to know. Ouchie. Oh shit, I'm gonna die. I'm not careful. Ah! Uh. Take this! Fuck! Give me the mental health, please! I need mental health! Oh, crap. I need mental health. Every time you lose all your mental health, you'll peel off a layer of your astral projection. If you lose all the layers, and you will no longer be able to maintain a projection in this mental world, and you'll be kicked out into the real one. No! Not real life! Please! I'm just going to see if I can fix my Galax alarm right now, because it's annoying me. Galax alarm, are you working now? 
It's working! Finally! I waited so long, but it's working again. Okay, it's working, good. Now I can go, woo! Okay, good. Um, your game was automatically paused while you were away. I wasn't away long, but thank you. Okay. Collect markers like this and the goggles to replace layers and collect markers like this to increase how many layers you can maintain at once. Ooh, I want the golden one. That sounds fun. Okay, this time I will not die. I promise you that. Oh, I took some damage there. That's not a good... Okay, I think last time I just wasn't picking up enough little mental health balls. That was my downfall. <clears throat> I can see a crying little bag over there. Come come here, you poor baby. Ah, it's like a little tartan bag. That's nice. Go on. Fly away, you little thing. That's right. Reminds me of Banjo-Kazooie so much, those weird bags. Boom! Wow, when you blow them up, it blows up all his friends. That is... That is horrible. Oopsie oops. Okay, the reason I'm backtracking is I want to um, get on that slidey thing. The grind rail. The grind rail looks fun. Looks like a tape measure. Oh, I fell down. I'm the worst platformer ever to grace this earth. Come on. Bop. Bop. Be up. Bop. Okay, let's go. Grind time. Woo! Oh my god, this is so cool. That was cool. Oh crap. Oh. Oh snap. Where am I? Oh no. Oh no, not again. Okay, I got away. I escaped. Give me your mental health, now. Give me your mental health, please. I'm gonna die. Good. So can you do that in real life? Like, you can get mental health by hurting others. Is that real? So if I, like, hurt someone, I'll get more, better mental health? That doesn't seem right to me. Why does that happen? I don't want to fling away. Stop flinging me away. Okay, this guy's gonna get it. Take that. Oh no, wait, I get it. These are like, what do you call it? It's me These are mental whatevers. That's why it gives you mental health when you kill them. Don't try that. <laughs> so if I hurt people, I'll feel better. Um, you're deepened by one layer. Woo! Our projection has been restored. Our actual projection is so healthy now. Oh yeah, I can like look around. Oh, that's a bad idea. <laughs> I want to look up. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, let's get back on this grind. Woo! That looks so cool. <laughs> uh, they can't use ladders, they're stupid. Okay, time to break this target. I could have done that earlier, but... Oh, I should have done that earlier. Because I just had to go up here anyway. Woohoo! That's what I thought. So, what are the l little evil things called again? I forget the term they use in the game.
Well, this has gotten a little more spicy. The, the little men, yeah. Yeah, and the little explodey guys. So they have like a name. Sensors. So they're, the guys, are, the, the people are sensors. What about the other ones? Do they have a name or are they sensors as well? Like, what are these guys over here? I found a cobweb. Let me dust it. I want to get the dust so bad. I'm tired of all these cobwebs. Oh, I'm pretty good at this. Let's tag. Thank you. Fire is very loud. Very, 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 very loud. I turned down the volume a bit just because of the fire. There we go. I didn't want to hit that yet. Yeah, I think they're all called sensors. Damn it, I didn't get... I wanted to see if there were any more figments up there. Shooting things is fun and useful. No, once you lose control of your own mind, it's very hard to get it back. Yes, one's thoughts must be 100% controlled at all times. Well, no. Actually, if you try to completely suppress your undesirable feelings, they'll build and build and eventually explode. Oh, so, uh... What would happen if you were to, say, completely block off all your sensor outlets? Well, there would be a build-up of sensor energy within that would, uh, eventually... Oh my. Run, Rasputin, very fast. You are my own creation! I command you to stop! <laughs> that is a big boy. That is a big sensor. That is a big sensor. When your mental focus is locked, press A and use blah 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 or left in any direction. Very useful for circling your enemies. Mm -hmm. I already discovered this actually. Look, I can circle my enemy. Hiya, 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 hiya. Hiya, 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 hiya. Hiya, hiya, hiya. Okay, I'll stop saying that now. Heal me up and put me down. Okay. <laughs> He's just stuck to the uh, stamp. Just realize there are other sensors over there. His health is recharging. What the fuck? Oh, I see. Oh, the, the little sensors are giving him more health. I figured it out. Yeah. He's being re-energized. Oh, Jesus. I'm trying, my dude. Ah! <laughs> this is awesome. What a cool boss fight. He's faster than me! There you go. No more re-energizing now! Oh my. The little guys are everywhere. How do I fight the little guys? Oh, I guess I have to... Ouch, 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 that hurts. I can't kill the little guys! Oh, yes, I can. I just have to not aim. There we go. 
so jiggly. He is. You're right, actually. He's very jiggly. Oh my god, I'm, I'm actually sucking so much. I'm being swarmed by the little guys. It's so annoying. Okay, I guess that's the way to do with it. What is that thing he's throwing? It looks so gross. Is that a meatball or something? It's not throwing your meatballs at me. I'm a vegetarian. I don't want any meatballs. Oh god, the meatballs are going all around the whole world and then back again. That's dangerous. Oh god, the meatballs. The meatballs! The meatballs! I can't deal with these meatballs. Oh god! This is actually hard. Why is this so hard? Give me your mental health. Give me your mental health. Give me your mental health. Thank goodness. Oh my... I'm getting so overwhelmed here. I think he's almost dead. There we go. That was kind of annoying, that boss fight. The meatballs so started building up. <laughs> Thank you. Finally, I have the merit badge. Sounds a bit like the Rocky theme tune. Oh yeah, boy. Oh, that was epic. Holy shit. Woo! That was so cool. Is it going to do that every time I get like a badge in this game? Because that was awesome. You did the thing. I, want to shoot more I did the things. thing! Okay, okay, enough about my yeah. mind. Stay out of my mind for a while. Let's just go back into yours, huh? Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. His mind is a mess. My god. I thought he said it was organized. That was messy as fuck. This guy's a w hot mess over here. Uh-oh. My controller's gone weird. Oh, my controller turned off. I might have low battery. I have low battery right now. Um, let's just try. So what do we do now? We go inside the mind. I want to shoot more things. Okay, okay. Enough about my mind. Let's stay up. Step up to the brain. Okay, so I'll go back inside my mind. Let's see what happens. Okay. Time to face my Oh, big control has gone off again. Personal demons. That's the spirit. I might have to use keyboard and mouse. Let's tr let's do it. Keyboard and mouse time. Let's see if the game plays on keyboard and mouse properly. Um, okay. Oh, Jesus, it doesn't play very well. My God, why does it do that? There's no way to stop moving once you're moving. Why is it... Is it why? That's so b bizarre. Okay, that's broken. Um, let's pause the game. <laughs> uh, I'll have to get another controller. I'll be two minutes. BRB. Put the, even put the BRB screen up. Professional streamer. I'm back. Fantastic. Let's hope. Yay, it's working. <sighs> Guess what, chat? I made tiramisu today. Do you guys like tiramisu? Tiny observer. Do you like tiramisu? I, I made it this morning. It's, it's ready now. Because it takes like six hours to set in the fridge. But it's ready now. And I'm going to eat tiramisu. Sounds delicious. Oh, it is. My tiramisu is different from other tiramisus. So most tiramisu you make with egg whites. I don't use egg whites. Oh no. I make a zabaglione using uh, egg yolks and sugar. I whisk that up under some uh, low heat. And then I mix that with whipped cream. Is that all I do? And I add a vanilla extract. And that's how I make my tiramisu. And then, of course, you get coffee and you dip it in, you dip the lady fingers in coffee and you make, you, you know, you present it all nice. Yeah, it's a bit different from normal tiramisu, but it tastes way better. And it's horrible for you if you're lactose intolerant because it's, there's a lot of whipped cream in there. But if you're not lactose intolerant, then it, it's all good. It's just better than normal. Please give, I'll post uh, pictures of it later in the Discord. And you can pretend you're eating it. And I'll post the recipe as well. I'm actually thinking of making a YouTube video of that recipe. Because it's awesome. Yeah, I might have to go. 
I should probably go now. So anyway, that was fun. A bit of a short play session this week, but next week it should be longer. Because hopefully my PC won't do this to me again. Um, I had a lot of technical issues today. Hopefully next time. You should. Cooking content is great. Yeah, I've been thinking about that and it would be quite easy for me to make cooking content. And I've got some good recipes I want to share. For like hummus, pesto. I've got one for tiramisu. Pizza as well. I can show you how to make pizza at home. I've got loads. You only stream Thursdays, yes. At the moment, yeah, I'm only streaming Thursdays because I'm trying to focus on my YouTube stuff. Um, so that's why my uh, I used to stream like every day, but we've cut it down to just one day a week. But um, I'm aiming for a two to four hour stream. So today's on the short side. I need to go and do things now. I'm needed. I need to pick people up from work, drop them home. Um, so yeah, I've got to go. But guys, thank you so much for joining. Tiny Observer, much appreciated that you're here again. It was lovely having you here. And yeah, not much else to say. So if you're watching on YouTube and enjoy the content, please like, subscribe, hit the bell button. My socials are down there in the description box. Join the Discord if you're not joined already because the Discord is awesome. And until next time, Karaku! Bye-bye.